All right, this video is going to be about going over how to get the highest uh, troops that you can, which are the T5s, the M5s, the A5s. This video is just going to go over how to get there the fastest way that you can. Um, up front, and to be honest, just like the video I made about getting T4s faster, if you want to get them fast, you're going to have to spend money. You're going to gonna have to get gold packs. You're going to have to buy what you need to do. Um, one of the main things is having the two training, two building, two researching. It's mostly the researching that you need to do. But you have to get your TC, your town center level, 227 so that you can get your academy 227. Because once your academy is at 27, you can start researching to get your T5s, M5s, A5s. And so when you come over here and you unlock um, the academy at 27, you can start researching. And as you can see, scrolling over here, all of the level five troops are at the very end. Doesn't matter if they're a cowboy um, is what a lot of us call the, the T5s. Um, the agents are now A5. Um, the mercenary are... Um, M5. All right, so when you click on it, you can see what you need to have done in order to get any of the level five troops. And first and foremost, you need to get your academy to level 36, which means that your town center has to be at level 36. And then it'll tell you all the different types that you need to have your troop defense, your cowboy academy ability. So let's focus on building first and foremost, okay? Let's go back home. I currently have the two building uh, queue and I have the two research queue. You can go over here on the left hand side where the arrow is and you can see the second research queue is there and um, the second construction queue is there. Um, I have two constructions. It already is timed out, but you can buy that in a gold pack or you can come up to the elite trade. Uh, you can go and get the second construction queue. So I'm going to go ahead and buy that right now. It's 2000 in gold. All right. In order to get the second research queue, uh, which I currently have one going and I have six days left because I just started it last night to start the second research queue. And um, you can buy that in a gold pack. And there's quite a few different uh, gold packs that you can get. Um, this is the main one. And it's it's going to cost um, $20 to get the second research queue if you want to get a 30-day one. Um, in order to get a 7-day one, it costs $5, like $5.99 or, or whatever your, um, your, your funds are in the world. I'm in the United States, so it's in dollars. But 30 days is a really good deal for $20. So I'm going to I'm going to go ahead and purchase this. All right, once you purchase it, of course you're going to get the the gold and all of the other things that are associated with this particular package package which is all of the speed ups, the um chest for the resources, um rare materials, silver alliance um that'll give you to your alliance and whatnot. So it's actually a really awesome thing when you buy the gold pack. But in order to get the second research queue, it's going to be beneficial to you. Now, because I currently have one that's six days, I'm not going to start the 30-day one until the second research has timed out. But also, don't start it if you have two researches that, um, say, you have two researches going and they're both 20-day researches. If you start the second research queue you're basically going to waste 20 days unless you use speed ups to get one going that it'll be wasteful and you'll basically just waste your time having the second research cues. So be very aware of that. Now, as you um as you continue to build and get um get up to level 36. Now I'm at level 28. Uh you can click on the building to see what needs to be done in order to get your um town to where it needs to be your tc 
Now, a lot of people uh, like to upgrade every single building in their entire um, in their entire town to the level that that max can be. But in order to get to thirty six faster, to get your level five troops faster, you're going to need to skip over that and just upgrade what you need to upgrade. Right now, I'm building my cabin from level 25 to 26, okay? Now, in order to upgrade my town center, I need that cabin to be at level 28. So I still need to build that cabin up. So uh, if you are smaller towns, I'd continue to build up at least one of each building so that you don't have to go back like I am. So if you want to build up to 36, like you have to do your research, you have to do all this. Um, so I'm going to speed up the, the cabin build so that I can get it done faster. And I have all these speed ups saved up. Like right now, look, I have two three day speed ups. So I'm going to use those. And um, I'm going to use one twenty four. An eight, a five, fifteen. So, I mean, I can use a lot of speed ups, and in order to get more speed ups, do your gang of bandits, do your um, events that will give you those speed up resources so that you can really just start doing this a lot faster. Buy gold packs that have speed ups, they have specific gold packs that you can get to to just get speed ups. I mean they they're called like speed up gold packs. Let me see if I can find one here. Do 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 do. Um maybe they don't have one on this particular day. Oh look, there's research speed ups. So you can buy this gold pack to get research speed ups. And this one's kind of cool because it's only a 99 cents one. So it's a one time only. Um when you click on the more button, you'll actually see everything that you'll get so you'll get two three hours um 10 one hours three 30 minutes two 10 minutes and those speed ups are great i mean this is a good deal so i'm gonna get it all right so they have all these different speed ups and of course they keep going um they get bigger and bigger as you get the different types of speed ups like this one's five four ninety nine five dollars and um just just keep getting those. This is a research speed up. You can get ones just regular speed ups. Uh, like this one, you can get a super construction pack. And I mean, I, I've i never gotten a gold pack for this much money. But if you really want to get T5s or the troop level five um, faster, you're going to have to spend money the fastest way. Okay. So my uh, cabin's built up to 26 now. So I need to build it up to 28, remember? So I need to um, go ahead and start building up. Now, once you pass a certain level of your your town, it's going to start charging you. Um, the cost is going to be the newer resources, what the game calls the growth resources, okay? So be aware that once you pass a certain level, you will need to um, start using your growth resources. Now, I've been collecting, I've been saving because I know that I want to do my builds and my researches as fast as I can to get up to that level. So I have the second research queue and I went and bought that second um, construction because I knew I was going to do this for the video, okay? So I'm not going to start the research queue for 30 days because I have a six-day one um, a seven day one that's in the process of counting down right now. And I have two researches going already. So I don't want to waste that seven day one by applying the 30 day ones because it'll just, it'll override it and start the 30 day one. So make sure that you're being smart about when you start your second queues, okay? So right now I need to start the second queue for my building and I'm going to build up the, um, the, uh, cabin so I can then uh, speed up and start churning my my town center okay um, doo -doo -doo. all right and this is gonna take 18 hours so I'm gonna go ahead and use speed ups to get that taken care of 
Um, and as I'm doing this, um, people are going to be helping me count down. So you, another thing is to be in a big alliance or an alliance where there's going to be people to help you, to give you the alliance assistance so that you can start knocking down these um, building tasks to smaller and smaller amounts. The more research you do, the smaller, like there's an alliance help that just popped up. Um, it knocks down the time that it takes to churn and uh, build and do these things. So as we wait for uh, that to start finish churning so that I can click on the free, then um, it'll go from 26 to 27. All right, there we go. Someone else helped me. Now I'm going to need to churn the cabin from 27 to 28, but I need the mine to go up to 28. So I'm gonna go down here, click on the mine, and I'm going to uh, do the mine next. Um, I like the way that the game is interactive and helps you know exactly what you need to do in order to uh, do the next task. Now, um, I'm gonna speed this one up as well, and people are gonna help me as well. I have enough speed ups that I can uh, do this really fast, uh, but I did this on purpose so that I could make this video so I'd have enough speed ups to do this, okay? Uh, look, people helped me to the point where I I didn't have to use as many speed ups as I wanted or, or that I needed, okay? And also this is helping me in the Inferno event, as you can see. I've already gotten uh, way past the points in the Inferno event, so as you're building and doing these things, other events will come into play and you'll get rewards from that as well, which is awesome. And that will only help you. Now, this is giving me honor seals because I'm at the point in the timer of the day that that's the Inferno rewards that I'm going to get, okay? Also getting gold and whatnot. Now that I have built my mine up to 28, all of my farms, so I have these four farms right here in the middle, they're all up to the highest level that they can be. As you can see, there's no green arrow next to it, so I can't build these until I build up something else. So now I'm going to go up to the cabin, build it up to level uh, 28, and we are going to get this knocked out here. Alright, so this is taking less than a day, so people are going to be helping me, but I'm going to start speeding it up. Alright, so speed up. Speed up, go to three hour. So if people aren't helping me, I like with Alliance help because they might not be online, that's okay. I'm gonna keep using my speed ups, you know? And sometimes you use the speed up and then someone helps you at the same time so you lose a little bit of time, but that's okay. All right, now that I have that cabin built up to 28, I can now click on my town center and I can build my town center up to 29, all right? So I'm gonna go down here and use my resources to get up to 29. Now, I try not to waste food because I have um, I have troops that are gonna eat it up. So I just wanna make sure I have enough grace to still be able to start the construction but have enough that it doesn't run down, but also not waste any. Now, this is going to take four days. Now, at when you surpass TC 27, you're going to start seeing that it's going to take less time to build from 27 upwards because when the game added that in, um, you, you then switched over to using the new resources to start building up all the buildings on this side, not just the mercenary side and the suburban town. Uh, you are going to need from 27 upwards with your TC to start using all of the new resources and uh, not the not the old resources, uh, which a lot of players call it old and new resources, even though they're called the growth resources are for the new suburban town and also the original. Some of you have started the game after the, the suburban town has already been um, introduced to the game players. Uh, and you can't get that suburban town until you are TC 15. That's when that suburban town unlocks, okay? All right, now I can use speed ups to get this one up too. 
So let's go ahead and use it because I have plenty of 24 hours because I just bought some gold packs with them. I've earned some in events and whatnot, right? Um, as I've been talking, people were able to come in and help me as well. So that, uh, that has helped to get that timer down as well. All right, and I have two minutes left, two, a little over two and a half minutes. So I'm going to go ahead and use a five minute speed up, all right? So now I am at TC29, and of course you get the benefits of getting the TC uh, upgraded, and you'll get all of these speed-ups, you'll get a, a town center chest, march size increases, um, so let's go in and, and uh, um, open that chest to see what rewards we get, okay? Uh, so we get uh, 7,600 in gold, we get 24 hour speed ups, 24 hour training speed ups, research, all of these. So this is, as you grow, you'll get benefits. So um, e once you surpass your TC to 27, it's gonna help move you along even quicker to get those level five um, troops, okay? Now you also can go in here and claim all of your um, uh, boom town as well your rising splendor so as you get this this is a pack that you can buy for i think it was 19.99 but when you buy it you can start getting these gold rewards so once i build up from 29 to 30 i'm going to get 12 uh, 500 in gold which will help um i didn't think that was a way i don't think a lot of the things that i buy in this game is a waste of money there are some things that i have bought that i think are a waste of money now when you go in here to research and you go down to the last three, the crystal sets, the advanced econ uh, economics, and the advanced combat are all unlocked after you build your TC up to 27, which you have to unlock that in order to start researching to get your level five troops, all right? So now that I'm at agent training, my academy needs to be at 29. So I've built up my TC to 29, so now I'm going to build up my academy and of course it's using new resources i have plenty that i've been stockpiling up because i knew this this was going to happen because i mean i've i've talked to other players who have been uh doing this for a little bit and they're a lot bigger than i am uh, i usually grow really slow um this game is not um i don't have a sense of urgency in this game but i do want to help you guys that have that sense of urgency to start getting um bigger growing faster getting the the larger size troops okay so now in order to get that building up and done so that i can start researching more because i i want to do that uh, i'm going to use speed ups okay but let's go back to the research tab in the uh, academy uh, for the advanced combat now when i researched this up to the max level i said okay i need to get my academy up to 29 um, I left all of these at the lower level because I just wanted to start unlocking everything that I could up here um, in order to unlock the um, the next level of troops for the mercenary side, the, um, the agent side. I need to have my academy up to 29. That's why I wanted to skip getting all of the other researches uh, past level one because I wanted to get that unlocked. As you can see, that's the only next step I need in order to unlock this next research, all right? So that's why you have to look at what needs to be done. Do that first so that you can unlock, okay? So the next step is to get that, then agent troop defense, um, unlocking the, the third level. So I need my agent troop life to be at level eight. I need my agent troop defense to be at level, level eight as well. I won't even be able to unlock this third level of troops until Academy is at 32. So this just helps you to set your priorities to what you need them to be to unlock what you need to be, have done, okay? So um, that's why having the, the second research queue is good. Like right now I have one that's a long research, but then I have a shorter research going so that I can do the shorter researches and speed those up faster, okay? So I am going to go ahead and speed up this building so that I can start doing research and, and um, increasing my research to get those 
um, level five uh, agents, uh, level five uh, troops, okay? All right. Okie dokie. So now I have that building queue. And um, as you can see, my TC, I need to keep building my TC in order to um, get it to the highest level. Like I need my TC, I need my academy to be at level 36 in order to even start researching. So I'm going to click on my um, building right now and I see I need to have the defense factory at 29. I need to have the hospital at 29. And when you click on those, you can, it'll take you to it. Uh, it is currently at 28, but I need to upgrade the blacksmith before I upgrade the defense factory. Click on the blacksmith. Now, it doesn't have a green arrow next to it, so I'm going to click on that. I need to upgrade my farm first to get that. So when you follow these steps and do it like this, It'll help you go faster so that you're building the right buildings in the right order to get your TC up faster and faster and faster, okay? So granted, right now I'm showing you the best way to do this, um, getting speed ups, um, fire farm, do all these things that I've been posting videos to get resources, to get what you need. Um, like right now, I am just constantly gathering if I am not doing a joining a gang of bandits and whatnot, my main focus is to just get all the research, all the buildings done so that I can start researching and, and training your, your level five troops because those level five troops are the highest in attack. So start doing that. Start building faster and doing what you need to do to do that. Use your speed ups and, and you guys will get there faster than you know it. It's going to take a lot of the older resources to get your TC past um, 27 and then your academy to 27 because it uses the older resources. And some of these buildings take like 50, I think one of them took like 76 days, um, but then the Alliance help helps a lot and just be patient with yourself, but you can do it. You can get those speed ups, you can get it going, you can get the research, um, you can get all of this done fast. Then once you start training, you will be able to get all of them uh, up and running. So just be patient with yourself, but if you want them faster, you got to spend the money, truth be told. I hope this video helped you guys. I know it was a lot of talking and um, hopefully it made sense. If you guys have any questions, leave them in the comments below, find me in the game or even online. I am uh, really busy. I'm planning a move right now, uh, starting a new chapter in my life. So um, if I don't post videos or if I don't answer right away, it's because I have a lot going on on my plate. I'm still trying to make videos, still trying to help you guys, and I hope you guys enjoyed this. I'm pretty sure I've missed some key elements into um, making sure that you do this faster. But the main things are if you want to get stuff done faster, you have to stockpile, you have to spend money. And that's the main thing. All right. I hope you guys have a great day and I will talk to you later. All right. Bye.